what dial would you say that you were on? You're on channel what? Okay, well, we're going to use a radio dial. We're going to say 98.5. So on your worksheet, you'll see the radio station. I want you to plot yourself on 98.5. Boy, and how do you know when you're on dial 98.5? You can tell by how you feel. Wow, it feels good. And when you're on 98.5, how great is your life? It's fabulous. You've been there before, if you're not there right now. Everything comes to you quickly and easily. You get what you want fast and quickly and easily. You attract other people in 98.5. You're in the 98.5 playground. However, not everybody in your life is on 98.5. Is that true? Mm-hmm. So I have somebody in my life, her name is Betty, and well, Betty's on a different station than I am. How can I tell? I can tell by how I feel. Matter of fact, Betty's favorite station is 30.1. So on your worksheet, I want you to plot your Betty, unless you're sitting beside him or her. <laughs> so put your Betty on your worksheet. Betty could be Bob as well. Boy, there's lots of distance between those stations, isn't there? There's lots of distance between when you're on 98.5 and your friend Betty, who's on 30. But by the way, do you all have a Betty? No? Oh, good for you. <laughs> now, I want you to draw an archway from your vibration to Betty's vibration. Boy, that's a big distance, isn't it? On that archway, I want you to write the word resistance. What kind of vibration is resistance? It's negative. 